In this video, I'm going to show you how to sell the missed call text back feature using Go High Level to small local businesses. So I'm going to show you how to set everything up A to Z. And this isn't just going to be a regular old missed call text back feature. This is going to be a missed call text back feature that's AI powered. So instead of just sending out a basic message using an automation, we're going to have AI actually start a conversation with the lead and try to get them to book an appointment or the business. So what exactly is the missed call text back feature? Well, if we have this feature activated, What's going to happen is whenever someone calls a business and the business owner doesn't pick up the person who called will automatically receive a text message that says hey sorry we can't come to the phone how can we help or something like that the whole goal of this is just to make sure that the business owner is reaching out to the lead as soon as possible and they're not just ignoring them and now with ai we can make this more advanced and actually have a real conversation so why is having this feature important for a local business well speed to lead is everything and 75 percent of sales go to the vendor who responds first also if a lead reaches out to a business and they're not responded to within five minutes, there's a good chance that that lead is lost forever. So that's why it's very important for a business owner to reach out to a lead as soon as possible. So if a lead calls a business and they don't pick up, what that lead's going to do is just call the next business that does. And of course, we're not going to want that to happen for your client. So the whole goal of the video is just to show you a quick, easy foot in the door strategy that you can offer to local businesses just so you can get businesses to pay you as soon as possible so you can cover the cost of your go high level subscription and like i said before we're going to be using go high level to build everything out and go high level will give you a 30-day free trial so if you don't have a go high level account already you can check that out down below and 30 days is plenty of time to start getting a couple clients because this really is a no-brainer offer this is extremely easy for business owners to understand and for you to demo to demo this feature you can literally set up your client with go high level and on your demo call you can literally just call them up and show them how the AI bot will take over and start conversing with you and the reason why this is so easy to understand for the business owner is because they realize that they're missing a ton of phone calls as business owners they're extremely busy and they're not always going to be able to answer every single phone call so setting this up for them is going to help them a lot especially when their top competitors have a similar feature enabled and then also the AI aspect of this feature this alone will separate you from other businesses who are selling just a regular missed call text back feature so this is something extremely new and businesses really haven't heard this before so that's going to help you out a lot especially when business owners have FOMO fear of missing out and they understand that AI is important but they just don't know where to begin and how to implement AI in their business so that's where you come in so in a previous video I showed you how to build an advanced missed call text back automation like this one right here and this one right here was very complex because we weren't leveraging AI so everything that I'm going to show you in this video everything that we're going to build out is going to be a lot simpler than this so let's just go ahead and jump inside of go high level and i'm just going to show you how to set everything up so here we are inside of go high level and right now we're just inside of a test sub account so let's just say that we're building this out for a business owner all we would do is create them a new sub account and then we can come over here to the settings and to set this up there's two ways that we can do this the first way is an extremely basic way and it's by just going to settings and then coming over here to the business profile and scrolling all the way down until you see this feature right here that says miss call text back and to set up this ai miss call text back there's going to be two things that we need to do we're going to first set up the feature and then we're going to set up the ai bot in the back end and there's going to be two ways that we enable this feature and the first way like i said before is just going to be this basic way by just checking this box right here typing the message that we want to send out and then clicking on save so now whenever someone calls this sub account and we don't pick up that person's going to receive this message right here but that's it nothing else is going to happen and we don't want that we want whenever someone calls this sub account they get a tag that they're updated in our pipeline that we get notified etc and then after that the ai AI kicks in and takes over the conversation so I'm going to show you how to do that now if we just go back and we go to where it says automation and then we can just come over here and create a new workflow from scratch and we could just name this workflow missed call text back and then we can go ahead and add our first trigger so for this trigger we're going to do a call status and for this filter we're going to do call status and then we can do no answer and then we can do add filter call direction and we can do incoming and then we can save this trigger so now whenever someone calls the business and we don't pick up this automation is going to trigger and for the first action we can do something like a wait time and we can do like 0.3 minutes and the reason why we want to add a short wait time is just to make the lead think that this is a real person responding 
and that it's not just a robot. So after this wait time, we could then add a tag. And for this tag, we can just tag it miss call text back, save action. And we can also update them in our pipeline. So we can do create opportunity in pipeline. We can choose our sales pipeline. And then for the stage, we can just do new lead and then save action. Next, we can do an internal notification. So what this will do is just notify the business owner that someone called them. So I'm just going to type in internal notification and then you can choose whatever type that you want, either an email, just a regular notification or an SMS. So let's just do notification. And for this title right here, we can just do something like this missed call from and then we can come over here click on contact and then click on phone so this will just notify the business owner saying you got a missed call from this phone number and then for this message you can say whatever you want you can do something like this get back to them asap and then save action and then finally we're going to send a text message i'm just going to click right here and then search for sms and then down here is where you're going to write your initial message so you can say something like this hi there this is bob from location name we noticed we missed your call and we're here to help how can we assist you today? And then I also just said, when can we come down and give you a free quote? So the whole goal of this message is just to get that person to respond to this message. And then when they respond, that's when the AI bot is going to take over and continue the conversation and try to get the lead to book an appointment on the business owner's calendar. So I'm just going to save this. And just like that, we now have the automation that we're going to need to make all this work. Whenever someone calls the business and the business owner doesn't pick up after 0.3 minutes, that lead will get a tag. They'll be updated in the pipeline. The business owner will get notified and then and that lead will receive this text message right here. So like I said before, this is a simple automation. It's not like the automation in my other video that looks like this. Thanks to AI, everything's going to be simple. So let's go ahead and set up the AI bot. All you have to do is go back and then go to settings and then come over here to where it says conversation AI. And now to set up this bot, it's going to be extremely easy. We're first just going to check this box right here that says autopilot. And this is going to allow the bot to send messages automatically on our behalf. And then right here where it says supported channels, there's going to be a lot of channels that we can use for this AI bot. Right now, we're just going to do SMS. So whenever a lead responds to our automation text message, this AI bot is going to trigger. And then down here, you just want to add the business's name right here. So for this example, let's say that we're doing this for a plumber. I can just add their name right here. I'm just going to do impact plumbing. And then right here, this is where you can add a wait time before responses. So let's say that someone responds to our automated text message. Right now, it's going to wait two minutes before responding to them. And then you can limit the amount of messages that this bot can send. So if you don't want the bot to just keep going and going, you can have it eventually stop where a real person can go in and take over the conversation. And then if you want to send the bot to sleep, whenever you send a message manually or through a workflow, you can do so. Now, if we come back up here and we go to configure intents. So right here is where we're going to set up the appointment booking for the AI bot. So right here, we can just choose a calendar where we want the AI bot to book an appointment on. So we're just going to use this calendar right here. Now, if you don't have this box checked right here, what's going to happen is the AI bot is just going to ask the lead when they're free. They're going to give the lead a time. And if the lead says, yes, that works, then the AI bot will just automatically book the appointment but if you want the AI bot just to send a calendar link you can have this checked and the AI bot is just going to send a calendar link where the lead can click on they can go on your calendar and then they can choose the day for themselves when they're free and then right here you have your AI prompt so if we edit this, this is basically just going to give the AI bot some instructions on what they need to do. So this gives you a good template that you can go off of. So you can just edit this, explain who the bot is, what the goal of the bot is, and then anything else the bot should know. And this info right here will just help out the bot. Now, if we go to bot training, this is where we can train the AI bot. So pretty much any websites, funnels, landing pages, any URLs that the business owner has, you just want to paste them in here. And then if you click on get data, this AI bot will scrape this website right here so it can learn more about the business and then down here to train the bot even more we can include faqs so if i click this all you want to do is add any questions that the business owner might get on a day-to-day -day basis and then you just want to add the answers to those questions just so the bot can learn more about the business and then if you go to bot trial this is where you can test out the bot and you are just going to want to play around with this it's not going to be perfect right away so just continue coming over here to the bot training to make the bot better also come over here and edit your prompt until you get it as good as possible and that's pretty much going to be it once you have this in enabled right here and someone calls your client's business and they don't pick up first we're going to have that missed call text back automation trigger that automation will send out that initial text message and then if the lead responds to that text message this ai bot will take over and the bot is going to try to get the lead to book an appointment on your client's calendar so now that we have this set up for a business owner to set up a business on this sub account it's going to be very easy we can just go to my staff and we're just going to add them as an employee and then we just want to add their first name last name email phone and then over here we can give them 
me a password and this is the email and password they're going to use to log into your white label software and then if you come down here and you go to user permissions you're not going to want to overwhelm them with all these other features that go high level has so we can actually just disable all of these features right here except for the workflows and the conversations feature and then if you want to a few other features that go along with it like contacts or settings tags etc but the whole idea is just not to overwhelm the business owner because the confused mind doesn't buy so if we can make it as simple as possible for the business owner the better and then once you're done with this we can go ahead click on save and right when we do that the business owner will be added to this sub account they'll receive their login credentials where they can log in and once they log into your platform they're not going to see all of these features right here they're just going to see the few features that you gave them like this all-in-one inbox where they can communicate with any leads that they're getting so what can you charge the business owner for this feature well you can charge anywhere between 97 to 297 dollars a month depending on what you're giving them but what I usually like to charge for this feature is just $97 a month and at this price I found that business owners really don't even care it's just another small monthly price that they have to pay to run their business and business owners are used to paying for software they pay on average about $800 a month on software so they're really not gonna have a problem paying for your software and this right here is another company called podium that offers the same feature and this is what they charge for their software now of course they include other features in these plans not just the missed call text back feature but for us we just want to keep it very simple at the very beginning so like I said before we're just gonna to want to get our foot in the door get them on this feature start getting them some quick wins from this feature build our relationship with the business owner and then in the future you can start introducing other features of go high level and that's when you can start charging more and more for those features and for any reason if you're still thinking that there's no way a business owner will pay for something like this if you just go to Google and search up miss call text back software you're gonna see a ton of companies that offer this service and some of these companies right here only offer this feature so we can definitely build an entire software around this feature as well but like I said before go high level is an on one platform so you might as well upsell them on other features in the future so if we just click on one of these businesses here's a missed call text back company and if we go to their pricing as you can see here these guys are charging $99 a month and they're also charging a $99 setup fee so if you want to get some ideas on what to charge and what to include in your packages you can just go to Google and start finding companies that you can replicate so if you're thinking oh a business owner won't pay $100 for this service well these guys right here are charging that I've sold businesses for that much and many other businesses as well and like I said before we're gonna be able to stand out from these businesses right here because we're not just selling a regular missed call text back feature we're gonna be selling an AI powered missed call text back feature so guys that's gonna be it for this video that's how you can set up and sell AI powered missed call text back to local businesses if you guys want to start your 30-day free trial with go high level I do have a link down below also if you got some value from this video I would appreciate it if you subscribe to the channel and I'll see you in the next one